Yo, what's happening, everybody? It's Dread Man, and uh, this is another Best 2009 video, and now I want to talk about what is the best sporting event in 2009, or what do you think it is, man? Because let's face it, 2009, it was a great year in sports, and a lot of great stuff happened from uh, football to basketball to baseball to MMA to boxing, and um, I think the first thing that kicked us off this year was a great sporting event was Super Bowl 43 between uh, Pittsburgh Steelers and the Arizona Cardinals, and the Steelers was whooping some ass in the first, you know, half of the game, and then the, um, the Cardinals actually made, came back and made a game out of it, and uh, Larry Fitzgerald um, scored the... Um, the touchdown that uh, put them ahead, and then the Steelers knew they had to, um, you know, they knew that they had to close the show. So San Antonio Holmes um, scored the game-winning touchdown for them. Um, Cardinals defense couldn't hold up, even though they're not really doing so good in um, the 2009, 2010 year. But we'll see how the rest of the season goes. And um, in boxing, don't even get me started on boxing. It's, we had a great, we had a lot of great fights uh, in boxing this year. We had um, Shuka Shane Mosley versus Antonio Margarito, and. Um, Margarito got his ass tapped by Shane Mosley. I mean, he got exposed for what he was due to um, a ninth round knockout. And, you know, Mr. Plaster Raps. But, you know, and Shane Mosley will be fighting Andre Berto um, this year. Well, um, in the year of um, 2010, January 30th. And I'm going to do a full prediction on that. And uh, speaking of Andre Berto, who's one of my favorite boxers, he uh, fought Luis Galazzo. And that was a um, pretty back and forth fight. I had it um, even up until the 12th round. And um, Berto took it home because he dominated the 12th round. <clears throat> You know, he dominated uh, Juan Durango in a unanimous decision by knocking him down in the um, 12th, not in the second round. He outboxed him for the rest of the fight. Only had Durango win like maybe two or three rounds. You know, good luck to Andre Berto. And um, this year, um, Pacquiao, Manny Pacquiao dominated boxing this year with two vicious knockouts. He um, dominated um, Miguel Cotto in November with, um, you know, outboxing him from round six through 12 and knocking him down in rounds four and round two. And, phew, I told you he was gonna turn that dude's face into chopped hamburger meat. And uh, we'll see. We see who uh, Miguel Cotto faces next week. And um, well, uh, not next week, but next year. Um, and uh, he's a. Uh, and uh, Pacquiao is also set to face Floyd Mayweather uh, March thirteenth. And I'm gonna do a prediction on that too. And the, the return of Floyd Mayweather, he uh, fought one with Marquez. He uh, outboxed Marquez and outclassed him, even knocked him down in the second round, which is a uh, you know pretty good for Mayweather. Congratulations to Mayweather and. Um, Oh yeah, Eric Morales, he's supposed to be coming back next year to boxing, and I hope he fights out one more more cats, or, you know, I don't know if he's going to stay a lightweight or not. And uh, UFC, it was a great year in UFC, too, because in UFC 98, uh, Leo Machida, he ended uh, Rashad Evans' undefeated streak by, um, I think it was a second or third round knockout. And, um, he uh, out, out school and he outclassed um, Rashad Evans in the, in the worst way. And in UFC 100, which was uh, one of the best pay-per-views of the year, it was the, uh, the main event heavyweight bout between um, Brock Lesnar and Frank Mir. Brock Lesnar got his revenge on Frank Beer in the best way possible with a knockout, and um, <laughs> he flipped up the crowd, which is great. And um, anyway, in basketball, um, the Lakers dominated again. You know, it, that wasn't really a surprise to me. And um, in, in baseball, we had uh, come on the New York Yankees. Were any of you really surprised by that win? Because I'm not. I just got an email. But anyway. Um, to wrap it up here, what do you think is the best sporting event of 2009? Well, anyway, um, I'll see you later. This has been the Dread Man. Peace.